Welcome back. We're going to pick up where we left off last time by introducing hypertext markup language or HTML. If you recall, this is how we define web page content or basically tell what our document says. Hypertext markup language, HTML, is the standard markup language for creating web applications. Markup languages provide simple ways to describe documents and their structure. So for example, this is some pretty standard HTML markup. If we want to uh, have the word bibliography, we simply type bibliography. This is the content of, uh, that we want to put on our web page. And if for whatever reason we want this to be in italics, we can use the EM tag. So there's an opening tag and a closing tag. And EM just stands for emphasis. So by wrapping up or by marking up the word bibliography with these EM opening and closing tags, we tell the browser to show the word bibliography in italics. Important to say there are many markup languages. Uh, HTML is just one of them. Some others that you may have heard of or may encounter as you start to explore technology more are XML, that's extensible markup language, LaTeX, which is a system for uh, scientific and mathematical notation, and something called Markdown, which is a popular way to document projects on Git. Next time, we'll dig into HTML a little more deeply, and we'll talk specifically about the HTML elements that you will need to build a more robust website. Have a great day.